Hey, what's going on guys? Coming in here. Well, first of all, I'd like to thank all of you for uh, this interest around uh, my new project on upgrading ad or ED uh, standard Linux text editor to provide a visual interface to it, something like uh, VI does to X. And uh, uh, I want to give special thanks to William Malley, who has mailed me today uh, in the morning. Um, Kindly pointing out that uh, I actually downloaded uh, quite a bit outdated version of ED or Add Text Editor, and there is a much newer one from February the fourth of this year, and it's number one point eighteen. So um, I ran uh, the I ran the diff the, the diff command on that, and it turned out that quite quite a bit quite quite a few kind of cool improvements has been done there although the overall functionality is the same the code base is the same so just some minor improvements that can be read in uh in the like version version history basically anyways um i decided to spend time and effort to uh to actually rewrite everything because i didn't have much at that time and it's now it's really worth it to have the kind of the latest version and uh from now on, I would be building uh, on this one because it now really like kind of like feels feels much better than it was before. You can pass with the warnings and like uh, fix a couple of uh, harmless memory leaks, uh, mostly when the uh, uh, ad is exiting from like when you're exiting from the editor. But anyways, so uh, William, thank you so much if you're watching this. If you're not watching this, thank you so much anyway. So without further ado, let's actually get into the demonstration. So uh here here is the same editor so uh now as you can see like uh, i'm sorry i'm gonna be using the mouse pointer a little bit just, just to point out so uh I'm, we're not in the command mode so one of the major things we're now distinguishing the normal mode when we're in the kind of visual editor and the ed or add mode when we are in the mode of entering the add commands i'm sorry for pronouncing this ad like i said i know it should be pronounced as ed but uh i like pronouncing this as ad so um uh so let's actually yeah without further ado let's let's get started so i can say e and e stands for uh for edit and actually what it does it opens the file so i can say edit uh let's call vd.c and now if I use AJKL, just like in Vim or VI, I can actually navigate uh, through the text in the visual mode, which is one of the core features. Um, so here I see I have this, the current row, current column, uh, the file name, also the total number of lines, so some basic, uh, some basic stuff on, yeah, and we're down to the very end. So uh, we still can, now, now you might be wondering, so if I say like, uh, for instance, if I say, go back to uh, the add mode, say I want to append and uh, still this works, like let's say last line, and I'm not quite sure, it's actually, yeah, um, just yeah last line has just been added here uh it doesn't yet update the cursor position so probably it should have you know so uh changing changing the line uh in the command uh, in the command mode probably should also change the cursor position because that's a really really natural thing to do however i don't yet have this implemented anyways if i say line one and change for instance and uh i say like hello something I'm demonstrating already but anyway just, just to give just to give an idea uh, yes let's get out of here yes it's not always getting out from the command prompt uh, that naturally only in the, those places where I explicitly specify that anyways and yeah I don't yet have this like page down page up page down stuff anyways we just added a couple of new lines to the document which is cool now, if I try to open a new doc document, let's say like main.c for instance, it tells me the buffer has been modified, but to suppress this, I can simply say big E and uh, main.c. And I don't care about what happens in that one. So yes, I just have this like, like this. Uh, so yeah, here we go. Um, 
Yeah, I know it's still nothing special so far, but already it starts being look like uh, a real editor. <laughs> and it's again, it's, extre it's extremely fun to, to work in this. Um, so yeah, uh, I don't know. Yeah, probably uh, <laughs> like hours of work, but uh, but actually nothing, pretty much nothing else to to demonstrate. So I'll probably stop here. So I'll keep you posted, guys, uh, in regards to this project. And again, I thank you for the interest in regards to this project. This is it from my side. Thanks for watching. Until next time, and take care.